guys, welcome back to my channel. So this week, um, sorry, not this week. I know I haven't uploaded in ages and I'm really sorry, but it's because I got a pretty much full-time job. If you follow me on Instagram, you'll know that I just got a job at H&M and actually most of my clothes, like in this haul, are from H&M. So sorry in advance if you don't like that store for whatever reason. But yeah, I feel like I've picked out a really good bunch of stuff from like a huge amount of variety that they have. So let's begin this haul. I'll start out with the tops that I got recently. So this first one here is from Everland Clothing and it is just this sunflower top here. And this top is so freaking comfortable. It's just a little bit too big for me though, so that would be my only problem. I got it in small because there wasn't an extra small option. Like it's a little bit big, but honestly like it still fine i can still wear it i just you know it'd be preferable if it was a little bit tighter another really great thing about this top and i've been finding that i only buy tops that accommodate to this need nowadays is that i don't have to wear a bra with it pretty much like i don't wear tops that i have to wear bras with anymore because i fucking hate wearing bras All right this here is another one of those bra free tops and it is from asos and it's this metallic purple knit top and the back of it is really cool as well. It's just got like a little strap across the back. And I find that this keeps the straps up from falling and that's really awesome. And look at how freaking shiny it is. Oh my God, it is so beautiful. And I actually do have the matching skirt to show you a little bit later on. Okay, and then I have this crochet top. It's kind of like a pink camo. It's a little halter top from Beginning Booty. And it is so cool. Again, no need to wear a bra. It's fully adjustable as well. So I feel like this could fit like a really big range of sizes. It is a bit too cold to wear it at the moment because I know I got a lot of summer stuff, but we are actually in the middle of winter right now. <laughs> but I pretty much shop for summer things all year round. So sorry, not sorry. Sorry, I nearly forgot. The final thing I have is my new watch. It's just this tiny, tiny little gold watch, which actually fits my little wrist. It is a Casio thing. I've been wearing it every single day, partly because I've accidentally set two alarms on this that I don't know how to turn off. So I have to wear it every single day in order to turn them off. But I would wear it even if I didn't have those two accidental alarms. <laughs> I really need a watch like this because at H&M there is no clock. So I don't have a way of telling the time while I'm working. So it's really important that I'll go on my break and my lunch at the right time or else I just miss the whole thing. So yeah, that's why I've gotten a watch. And honestly, I don't know how I lived without it before. It is so freaking handy. All right, so into the H&M stuff that I got, I bought this like sparkly boob tube from the divided section. And this is really, really cute. I felt like it was really early 2000s. And I don't know, this top makes me really nostalgic about that style that was really cool when I was in primary school. <laughs> um, and it's sparkly, so I couldn't walk past it. The annoying thing is, I bought this when it wasn't on sale and now it's on sale. Classic. This shirt I got from the men's section at H&M. I bought it because at my other job, Typo, we've been doing like dress ups on certain days of the week and on Fridays we have flanny Fridays and I don't actually own any flanny shirts. So I went out and bought one and this is actually so freaking comfortable. Like I find myself wearing it on days that are not flanny Fridays. This is just a plaid flannelette shirt from the men's section. I got size extra small. I wanted to get a size small so I could wear it as like a dress but the shoulders just didn't fit very well. Either way, this is like a really good quality shirt I'm finding. It's just, God, I really see the appeal of flannies now. They're so comfortable. Cause it's like, is it a shirt? Is it a jumper? I don't even know. And this one, ooh, I still have the tag on. I bought this for one reason and that's because it looks freaking amazing with my hair. This is the most gorgeous, lemony, zesty yellow. It's not coming up as bright as it is in real life on camera, but I swear it's verging on neon yellow. It's so bright and it just looks like a big ass lemon. I love it so much. And it's got the high neck and also the bottom is really cool. It's kind of got a slight asymmetric hem 
Anyway, it's awesome. I got this in an extra small as well. I'm wearing one of the things I got from H&M under my jumper and it's this top here. See if I can show you. Okay, so this is the top I got. It's actually meant to be a bra. To be honest with you, I'm just gonna be wearing it as a top. I love the straps, they don't fall off and it's like really tight and cinches in at the waist. And last but not least, from H&M, I've got these humongous hoop earrings and like they literally hit my shoulders when I wear them. They're so big, but I freaking love these so much. I wore them to a ball recently and got so many compliments. They're just like the most humongous ghetto hoops that I could find and so I had to have them. <laughs> cool. Oh wait, oh my god, I keep doing this, but I have one last thing from H&M. Because it's been quite cold here, I've been after thick, either fleecy or woolly stockings. And I found these ones on sale, these grey woolly stockings. <laughs> I'm not really sure how, how to describe it, but I think grey woolly stockings covers pretty much all the bases with this one. Full length stockings, and they're grey and woolly. <laughs> Sorry. That was the worst description ever. Look, you know what? I tried. Finally, we just have this skirt that I'm wearing. You can't see it right now, but I'll put in a clip. It's the matching skirt to that purple metallic top I showed you before. It's like a long midi skirt, and I've been digging midi skirts so much because I find that they're super duper flattering. All right, and I believe that is all. It's not a huge haul, but um, I hope you enjoyed watching it nonetheless. And hopefully it won't be like another two months until I see you. I've just been super, super busy with work at the moment between my two. I have three jobs technically, but I only work two of them at the moment. But between those two jobs, I'm working like 45 to 48 hours a week. And it's been kind of rough. The reason that I've been working so many hours is because I am going on exchange to San Diego in August. Yeah, so that's kind of big news that I've been meaning to tell you guys, but yeah, I will be in California in August. Ah! I'm very excited if you can't tell. <laughs> but in the meantime, I gotta hustle, I gotta get my funds together, I gotta get my shit together. There's so much I have to organize, so I apologize if I don't see you guys that often, but just know that my heart is with you. Anyway, I hope you have a good day and I'll see you next time. Bye.